our first development of 50 apartments, I'll never forget those days. We sold the development out in one Sunday afternoon, thought we were absolute rock stars, thought this was the easiest business in the world, and off we went and we decided to, we built the development in six months, did quite well out of it, paid back F&B, thank you very much F&B. And it worked out to a success story. We built the business from there. Along the way, I managed to acquire two extremely good partners. I mean, Rodney Gray is now our managing director, and Ulrike Schneidner, who's our very capable projects director. And then in about 2007, 2008, I think we got a bit carried away and built a few hotels and a big office park and really got into trouble owing the banks a little bit too much money and we bumped into some fantastic, we said as the period of our life we became Jewish, we bumped into Jonathan Baer and his bunch of extremely capable youngsters in the Buffett Investments Group, totally reorganized our business, got rid of all our, as they say in the Jewish community, got rid of all our dreck, got rid of all our hotels, shopping centers, etc. anything we had, we had a building in London, we stripped that out. And we focused on our core business, which is what we are today. You know, Buffett were very clear. You know, we, we managed to produce a 40% GP in our business, which is a, a very high margin. And we specialize in one thing. We specialize in four-story walk-ups. That's our business. That's all we do. We do nothing else. We constantly get asked to do high-rise apartment blocks, um, cluster developments, single houses. We just, we just don't look at it. We only do one thing, which is four-story walk-ups. We've specialized in it. We've been listed now at about a year. Share price hasn't done quite as well as I expected. But we had our first results that were out that were spectacular. We achieved slightly more. Second results are coming up now in, in February. And without saying too much, I think we're going to be on track. And it's a big number we're looking at. We've done extremely well this last year. And yeah, the, the market at the moment for Bowen, we've, we've developed into a national player, we're in, in the Western Cape, we're in Pretoria, we're in Joburg, we're venturing now into Durban, we've just picked up a fantastic project in Durban. So we're pretty widespread, and we're going to produce between three and a half and 4,000 apartments a year, that's our target market. It's pretty easy for us at the moment to achieve that. We actually, our construction division is actually underutilized at the moment, which we look into to expand that more into the into the rental business because we believe there's a massive gap in the rental market for in our in our sector. And then as you kindly said on the introduction, that's our dream is to split it out into a REIT in the future as a, as a residential REIT. So that's where we're going. Um, we've obviously been very successful with the waterfall deal. That's the biggest transaction that, that nobody quite under, understood in our pre-listing statement. You know, that's, that's a 15,000 apartment play that is. It's, it's absolutely enormous that is. You know, the, the, we started selling the first, the first one, the polo fields, and it's been ridiculous, the sales. We've done the, probably the softest launch we could do, and we've exceeded all our expectations on the numbers. It's, it's unbelievable, the demand. And we haven't started a waterfall yet. You know, we've, we've just luckily, um, I've just come back from Dubai with Amirs, because we were quite fortunate to win an international property award in Dubai one of our developers, which we're quite proud of. And they just extended our, our, our land holdings in Waterfall. Well, not really our land holdings, our development rights in Waterfall. You know, we're probably going to take it up to about 20,000 apartments in Waterfall now. And we've just, you know, one of the reasons why people like our product is that our products, our product has basically got a minimum, our sites are a minimum of 1,000 apartments. What we do differently is we create a lifestyle estate. You know, we've got fantastic clubhouses, really good facilities, very, really well-run estates, and that's what's making a big difference. And I've just come back from Dubai and seen some absolutely <coughs> spectacular technology which we bring into South Africa. We're going to be one of the first people that do it residential, and it's called Crystal Lagoons, where they do a, they do a, they've got all sorts of fancy technology where they basically create a lagoon within a development, and it's very, very low maintenance, very adaptable, and we're going to be doing that at Waterfall. We're going to be the leaders in the, in the market doing it. And I think it's going to make a massive difference to our, to our developments. And questions? Um, you said for 40, uh, gross profit for 40% of the gross yeah. profit. Um, is that their cost including land plus then you add 40% to land? That's everything included. Yeah. 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 Okay. I 
think because remember there's two fundamentals in ball which we do differently it's, and it's a big it's a it's a bit too big numbers we do our own marketing we've got an in-house marketing team and we do our own construction those are two big numbers that make a massive difference to our business and i believe we're very very efficient with our design and our economies of scale and our cost engineering i believe we are leaders in, our, in the cost engineering in our business you said four, uh, four story walk up? Yeah, that's all we do. Uh, would, would that be too late or uh, a sectional title? In which case, do you have a sectional title duplexes, one on top of the other? How do you do it? What we do, and this is quite a, it's, it's, not, that, it's not that complicated, but when you, when you, I should have actually put some slides up and drawn some silly cool pictures. But we do, we do quite a unique um, development. We do four stories and we do 10 apartments in four stories. So there's two apartments on the bottom of three bedrooms, two three bedrooms above it, then it changes to two two bedrooms, and then the big secret it changes to four one bedrooms on the top. And there's four one bedrooms on our, our biggest one, and we're, we're, this, we're very unique in that. Very few people have got that right. It's the, the biggest trick with it is the engineering of it, to get it correct. The architects really need, the, the architects and engineers really need to work together, and we understand it. And there's four one bedrooms. The youngsters don't give a damn about walking up three flights of stairs, and those four one bedrooms are an absolute winner. And it also helps us tremendously with the council, with the fact that the council wants us to have 20% social housing, and actually we've got 40% on our developments. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, thanks, good, good. Thanks.